Hello, I'm Christopher Mose. I'm Sabine Schoenberg, and this is another edition of Smart, Healthy, and Green News. We have some exciting information today. We're going to start with an update coming out of Hyundai Motor Company for their luxury brand of Genesis. It is now, they're teaming up with Amazon. Amazon's actually been teaming up with a lot of different manufacturers lately. This is voice-activated connected cars from your home. So connected home, connected cars makes perfect sense that those two come together at some point. So you, Minnesotan, you would like this feature of automatic startup. This is exactly what got my attention. So you can unlock your car doors, which is, okay, okay given. Okay, that, yep. But auto start, which Anybody that grew up in the northern cold climates knows how critical auto start in your vehicle is. So imagine the convenience of being able to just simply tell Amazon's Alexa sitting in your living room, start my car. Nice and warmed up, ready to go when it's time to go to work. Well, let's see. I mean, this is a very exciting development. They're the first out with this for this car. It is their new spin-off, so they want to do something really flamboyant, I think, and mm -hmm. um, this is groundbreaking. And I would add, you know, Amazon has been doing a lot of these partnerships, and we can definitely recognize that voice-activated connectivity with the smart home, home automation area is probably going to be the next wave. But we also would like to see manufacturers reaching out to some of the other systems because, yes. as you know, Apple HomeKit has Siri. Google even has some voice-activated components as part of their home system. So it's important, we, as we've discussed before, to really be integrated across the board. Universality is one of those key ingredients. And I hope very much Genesis will also not only look to Amazon, but all the other players as well. So the next up we have around the health area, air purification in the home. There's a new air purifier on the market that's actually breaking down contaminants at a molecular level. It's an interesting next wave in innovations in this area. It's called Molecule. The manufacturers here are really way ahead of the curb, I have to say, because I don't think consumers quite recognize just how polluted and how toxic their interior environments, their home environments really are. Manufacturers know that, know that this is coming down the pike with the increased insulation standards and increased foam insulation. Uh, homes are getting tighter. Everything gets cinched in. We need these air purifiers. This one is really, really good. Molecular, obviously, the smaller the particles, the more you can grab on that level, the better, no doubt. It's not an inexpensive unit. $799 is what it'll retail when it comes out in 2017, and the initial run sold it's gone. out. Yeah, so that tells you there is a real market out there. Slowly, people are recognizing this is an issue. And, you know, we talk about environmental health issues. Starting in your home to solve those and address them is probably a really good idea. But think about it, you probably need multiple units. You need something in your living space. You will want it in your bedroom, and if you have kids, you probably want it there as well. So the numbers here add up quite quickly. They do, and it'll be interesting to see if other manufacturers of air purification systems, particularly tied to the HVAC system, will upgrade to this molecular-based um, level of filtration. Yeah. Check it out. If you Google it, there's a lot of different product range already in place that you can get. This one happens to be probably the, the very best. So go check it out on Sabine's new house. Finally, we have a little bit of a nugget of information that came from Elon Musk's recent investor call um, with SolarCity and Tesla. It looks like, first of all, those two um, companies got the green light to merge, so that'll be some interesting innovations happening around that. Talk again about connected home, connected car. They are going to work that angle very strongly, it seems obvious. I am really, really excited. I've been telling people, look for breakthroughs in solar, and here I think is gonna be a really big one. The idea of not installing panels on your roof, which are ugly, but in fact use the shingles as your actual roof structure, that's what I think will make a huge push in the right direction. Now, solar shingles have been around. They've been not really successful because it was basically adding all these little solar pieces together and the breakdown came in the connection points. And that's what I'm still worried about. I'm sure they are too, and they figured this out knowing Elon Musk. He doesn't really mess around, and I'm sure we're going to get a generation leap with this new product series. I cannot wait because I think this makes so much sense. 
Definitely. So stay tuned. We can't wait to share more about this as information becomes available. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out our recent project, The Greenwich House. You can find more information on what we talked about today at sabinesnewhouse.com.